What is going on everyone? Welcome back to the channel and welcome back to another video. If you have not subscribed to the channel yet, make sure you guys go down below this video and click on that subscribe button. This evening, me and my good buddy, Lucas, he's been on the channel before we were out turkey hunting and he has been out bow fishing with me a few times. This evening, we decided to head back out to uh, one of our best spots on the Mississippi River on the backwaters here. The water is nice and high. We had a lot of rain. The last week or two have been really wet down here and this week now has been sunny and nice so the water is starting to warm up and it is high enough for us to get back to some of these good spots to bow fish. The water is not quite as warm as it was last year when we were here. If you guys saw last year's video, that's when we shot 150 some fish and uh, filled the floor of the boat and it was pretty insane. We did that in like three hours and it was a very good night. All the fish back here were splashing and it sounded like a white water rapid when we pulled in, but it's not quite that good back here yet. We have heard a couple splashes and a few fish uh, ripping around on the surface of the water. So I think we're gonna at least be able to stick some fish this evening, but I don't know how crazy it will be. Also, this is gonna produce some bigger fish, hopefully it did last year, than uh, the lakes we have been shooting this season. So hopefully we'll get some good fish, maybe some good numbers. We are just waiting till it gets dark enough to flip the lights on and see in the water we got another probably 10 15 minutes and we are going to start shooting here so i'm going to get the gopro and all my stuff ready and we're going to start trolling around and look for some fish are we going to shoot them up i hope so we're going to shoot them up i want some hogs you like the hogs buddy i like the hogs and sunflower seeds i made the mistake of buying a bag of sunflower seeds i usually don't get them because they're so addicting and now we've Very both addicting. just been demolishing that bag dill pickles dude that's almost gone already oh my and coffee Best combo for bow fishing. Yeah, Boyer's kind of a weirdo. He's like one of the only people, him and his dad, that I know that drink coffee like all throughout the day. They love their coffee. If you guys are big coffee guys and you drink coffee all day, comment that down below this video because I'm curious to see if anyone else does that because Lucas is the only one that I know that just loves coffee all day. Even Don't you drink it before you go to bed? Oh, yeah. Yeah, he, like, dr he drinks coffee to go to bed. He's like, that's my nightcap. I'm like, I don't know if that's how it works, but... Most people have a cocktail before bed or like... I don't know. I just drink coffee before bed and it puts me right to sleep. Alright, me and Lucas just flipped the lights on. It's still a little light out yet, but we it's can messing up my vision. We can my vision is not good. We can see a little bit. So we're gonna start just trolling nice and slow and see if we can come across one. Ugh, oh, the bugs are starting to come out. I don't like that. I like it when there's no bugs. We're gonna see a 30 pounder. Hmm. Come on, fishies. It's not too juicy yet, I'd say. Not yet. There's one. See it? Where? Very deep. It. Yeah, they're hard to freaking see. Big one? Yeah, I was all right. Probably around 20 pounds. Wow, I could barely freaking Dude, see, I that. see that. I know. I saw its body and tail, and then as soon as I said something, it went even deeper, and then you couldn't see anything. Otherwise, I was going to shoot at it. Good shot. Good shot. Good shot. I, think, I, I did not see that. No, they're just hiding in the weeds. This thing looks like a weed. All right, well, me and Lucas, we just uh, ripped around this whole spot, and it's been about an hour. We've seen, I think, five carp. I have shot one. The water is so high that you cannot see, like, any of the carp. They're hiding in the weeds, splashing around a little bit, but we can't get on them because the weeds are so thick, and you can literally not see anything, and there's so many places for them to hide. So we're going to get out of here. We might try one more spot on the river on the way back to the launch. Otherwise, we're going to have to resort to shooting a lake uh, because this is not working out. So we're going to get the the boat out of the water and we will update you once we decide what the heck we want to do. Okay, I just finished my Taco Bell burrito that you saw me eating. We had just arrived at the first spot that we are going to shoot. We're on a lake around home now. This lake has produced for a couple of the other videos this year, so hopefully it's old trusty and we can shoot a few nice commons here and uh, get a few more carp in the boat. Looks like something small in front on the edge of the lights. Oh yeah, there's two smaller ones up here. Oh, there's another one. Oh yeah, look at them all, look at them all. One right there, one right there. Are you on one? You can shoot if you're on one. I was. Yeah, it's 
this far. Oh, oh, dude, that was a good shot. It got off, though. Oh. oh. Missed him. Oh, there he is. There he is. Can you get knocked up? Where is he? Right up in the shore there. Oh, there's another one that just came out of the... Oh, he's chilling right there. He's chilling. See them? Two? Yep. Ready? Yep. One, two. 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 <laughs> Except you got it. No, you did. Nope. Oh yeah, I did and it got up. Oh my gosh, dude. Arrows suck. Yeah. I'm having the worst luck with arrows this year. Yeah, I usually don't have this many problems. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh my god, big one, big one, big one. Where? Hang on, hang on. Where? It's it's going straight right in front of you. Good shooting, brother. You might have to shoot. I don't know how far it's in. This was the new arrow, but that's a, oh, that's a big one. That's a big one. I'm gonna let it run. Let him run. Come on, I am. Here we go. There you go. Dang, that's a big boy. That's a freaking fatty. Oh, there's one. See it? Yep, stick it. Good shot. Smaller one. Should I shoot it? It's right in front of me. Yep, bump it. Get it. Oh my gosh, I did. I don't know how I hit that. That was very deep. Very deep. Is that a fish? Yep, there's one right there. See it? Where? A big one. Oh, yeah. It was deep. Dude, all these ones are... Nice shot! That was far. That was a good shot. Oh, of course. Oh. All right, we just got the shore. Lucas has got to go home, unfortunately. So he's just going to leave me solo. But we're going to weigh this freaking fat when I shot underneath these. I think we ended up with five fish here also. Fire it up, Terry time. I'm firing up kilograms, ounces, grams. Pounds. LBs, baby. Ooh. Ooh. Oh, yeah. Look at that fish. 23.40. I'm going to uh, get the boat out here with Lucas, and then we're going to drop Lucas off, and I'm going to go to a different lake tonight, and we're going to keep on shooting a little bit, so I will see you guys on the next lake. Just launched on the second lake of the night. And I'm solo now, and we're gonna see what I can do. Never bow fished this lake before. There's a dead northern. Water clarity's not bad. Holy heck. What the? Dude. Buddy. What are you doing? Was that necessary? Well, I think I have to go change my pants after that. It's like a pond back here. I don't know if I want to go in there. My god, there are freaking fish in there. Oh, here we go. Oh, they're trying to get up in this current here. That's why. There we go. Oh my god. He is running. I'll tell you what, I had to work real hard for this one. That took us a while, or me a while. Not very big, but I'll take it. We didn't get skunked on this lake. <laughs> Got it. Little smaller fish here than the other lake. There we go. 
Oh my god, there's like 10 carp in here. Oh my god. There's carp everywhere. Alright, just rolled into the next spot on this lake. It's about 2.30 in the morning. I spent a lot of time over on that other side, but I just pulled in and there was a nice school of good sized carp. It's probably eight fish, something like that, six to eight fish, just as I came in. Oh, here's one. There we go. I am on tonight. Another common. The right side lights are not doing good at all. We got three for three shots on this shoreline. That's deep, let's try them. First miss over here. Okay, I connected both sides of the lights to the same battery now. The last one that we had that was decent. They're definitely dimming down. We don't have much longer left, but pretty sure it's like after three in the morning. So I don't want to be out too much longer right now. It's 2.40. That was a far shot. I'm not sure how well you guys can see anymore with how dim these lights are, but hopefully you could see decent because I'm picking away at them here. Oh God, oh God, get me out of this. 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 <laughs> oh my God, what did I just get myself into? This is a cluster. Oh, that's barely in there. Jeez, first fish in. I don't even know, a long time. And we put ourselves right in the rhubarb in that tree. All right, well, I just arrived home and got the boat unhooked and we ended up with about a little over a half a barrel of fish. So honestly, not a bad night at all, especially for most of them being by myself. So the biggest fish that we shot was the one that we shot on the first lake that we went to. But that is going to wrap this video up. Thank you guys for checking out the video. If you enjoyed the video, click that like button and subscribe to the channel down below this video if you have not done that yet. And we will see you on the next one. All right, I can't do my signature see a move too loud because I don't want to wake the neighbors up at 5 a.m. So I'm just not going to do that. Or I'm going to do a really awkward, quiet one. See ya! Thank you.